what's going on guys and gals welcome to another episode of hugo smokes today we're going to be doing an unboxing of my latest purchase and i'm really excited about this one so stay tuned all right here it is and before i get this thing open let me tell you guys something i ordered this box october 21st uh that was a sunday i believe and usually it get, takes about five days at the most to get delivered so by the 26th i don't know what happened it's coming from new jersey i don't know what happened along the way um it got lost somewhere um i had a i actually called the vendor vendor advised me to call the post office and open up a claim um once i opened up a claim uh the box showed up magically at my doorstep amazing but yeah I'm really excited about this box. Uh, let me show you what's, actually I already opened it, but I didn't open the contents. So I just wanted to make sure everything was in there cause it was late. So, all right, got some. Okay. Comes with some nice stickers. Uh, probably could show you this like that without the domain. So this is the place I got it from, and this is a little preview. Uh, I can't show you this because it has uh, links and stuff. All right, it's fine. All right, guys, I'm excited for this. Um, I was actually looking to buy a sampler of this band all over the place, and I couldn't find it. And the ones they had, uh, I didn't like. But yeah, these guys, these guys uh, did a good job. So. It's this here. So I bought a, I, I bought a, a 10, 10, 10 cigar sampler pack. I probably should have showed the other one like this. Okay. I believe there is uh, six different cigars here and uh, two are double. So yeah. And then I got a freebie with that purchase of this here. And I'm gonna go through each one as blend uh, individually. So just taking them out. And I'm gonna save, and I got one more pack of five here. I'm gonna save that for for, uh, for last because that's the one I'm really, really, really excited about. But stay tuned. Let me get this, um, let me get these uh, out of the uh, packaging and set up so I can uh, talk to you a little bit about the blends. All right, guys, I'm back. So I stand corrected. October 21st was a Saturday. So that's almost a week and a half of torture waiting for these babies. Let me tell you, it was the longest week and a half of my life. And uh, number two, there's actually seven blends here, uh, which three are doubled up. So that makes 10 cigars. Um, plus the five bonus that they threw in um, as a gift, okay? So let's start off with the first one. Is um, And this is from the Placencia family, all 10 cigars. Um, this one is the Alma del Campo blend. And this comes, well, the, the sampler uh, comes in a 5x52. So it's a Robusto and it's uh, medium strength. Um, and the tobaccos in here are all Nicaraguan, uh, filler, binder, and wrapper. So that makes it a Nicaragua Puro. Take a look at that. Nice, uh, caramel color wrapper. Uh, next we got the, uh, Cosecha 149 and it's also in a Robusto size 5x52. The strength on this one though, it's a little bit, uh, on the plus side of medium, so it's medium to full or medium plus. Um, take a look at that, it's a five, five by 52. And this one here has all Honduran uh, tobacco, filler, binder, and um, the wrapper as well. So that's a Honduran Puro. Number three in the lineup is a Cosecha 146. And this Vitola is a six and a quarter by 52 torpedo, as you can see there, uh, medium strength. Um, this one, the filler on this one is a mix of Honduran Nicaraguan, and binder is Nicaragua, and wrapper is Honduras. So that's an interesting blender. 
I'm really ex uh, excited to uh, try one of these. Actually, this one, well, this one, I got two. This was the one that I got two of, okay? And up next is the Alma Fuerte Generacion Cinco. Well, they call it Generation V. I guess that stands for five, right? Uh, this is a very interesting Vitola. It's a seven by 52 Solomon. So it's the one that has a, the uh, thicker bottom there. And it's got the pointed tip. Um, this is a medium strength and uh, also a Nicaragua Puro. So filler, binder, and wrapper are all from Nicaragua. And next up, we have the Alma Fuerte and the 6x60 hexagonal. Going back to uh, elementary school, huh? Hex, hexagon, six sides. So it's a six sided cigar. Interesting press on this cigar. And again, this is also a medium, um, medium strength. Um, all the uh, Alma Fuerte line is, um, they're all Nicaragua Puro. So this is also filler, binder, and wrapper is all Nicaragua. So let's see how that tastes because usually the Nicaraguas are pretty spicy. Yeah, this is also like a caramel color. Um, we got the Alma Fuerte Eduardo in a six and a quarter by 52 Toro. And this looks like a soft box press. Uh, it's not uh, really a parejo with Tola. It's a, yeah, soft box press, I would say. Um, like I mentioned before, they're all Nicaragua Puros uh, with Nicaraguan filler, binder, and a wrapper. And this one is also medium strength. And I got two of those. So here are the two. All right, guys. Now, up next is uh, an interesting Vitola. Uh, this one here is the Alma del Fuego, and it's called the Flama. And it's a six and a quarter by 38 Panatella, they call it, which I guess some people call it also the um, Lancero, probably. So this is a medium strength, um, and it's also a Nicaragua Puro, filler, binder, uh, and uh, wrapper is Nicaragua. Um, so on this one, I got also the 6x54 Toro um, Vitola. And this is medium plus, uh, sorry, the other one also medium plus, and it's also a Nicaragua Puro. And last but not least, uh, so I got a five pack bonus of these here. It's a four and three quarters by 52 Robusto Vitola. Nice looking wrapper there. Medium strength. The filler on this one is Nicaragua Honduras. Uh, binder is Nicaragua, wrapper is Nicaragua, so predominantly Nicaragua um, uh, tobacco, so I'm expecting this one to be kind of spicy. And from my experience, the shorter sticks are kind of always more spicy than the, than the longer ones, maybe because it doesn't develop as much as the longer ones, I'm not sure. Um, but yeah. Um, so Alright guys, so stay tuned. For the main item in this order that I'm super, 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 super stoked about coming up. All right, guys, I'm back. Thanks for staying to the end. And now for the main event, the moment we've all been waiting for, the hot item in this order. And you guys, some of you guys might have guessed it from the stickers I showed you in the beginning. But if you didn't, here it is. It is the SP1014 Red by Sanch Patel and Chico Rivas. Um, yeah, this is, uh, let me take it out of the, the baggie here. This is a six by 52 Vitola. It's a Toro. Uh, and this one is comprised of all Dominican Corojo uh, filler, binder, and wrapper. So you got yourself a Dominican Puro, by the way, Dominican tobacco is my favorite tobacco. Uh, so this one, this is a 
the hottest stick on the market right now. Like everybody's trying to get their hands on this and um, well, if you guys are interested, you know, uh, look for this guy, you know, no domain, you know, um, and you can get yourself some sticks. Um, so that is all for this unboxing. Um, thanks for um, watching and don't forget to like, comment and subscribe so we can keep growing this community of, of uh, cigar uh, aficionados. Uh, see you guys on the next one.